Hi everybody, Protop Jim here and welcome back to Darkest Dungeon. Week 121 now. Slightly getting there. And things are slightly looking up. Put these away for a minute. I was looking at this trinket in a minute to have something good for my abomination. I would like to level some people up. I mean, I could go for that trinket. 100 quickness plus shre is quite thing difficult. Could be going for a risk. I would like to uh, get some of their abilities up first, maybe. And I've got that. I've got most of these other trinkets anyway. I want to get these leveled up, my people leveled up, so I can start taking out the grave of a job. I think I've got that trinket, don't I? Yeah, I've already got that one. So I was thinking maybe this. Get a few people up. Maybe even get them to level fives. That might be good. I put we can go for something like this. Maybe get my abomination up. She's got soft though, but I do need to clear that. Then first, a significant does a half a crit though. It's only problem with putting that on there. So I'll do that. Speed, accuracy, and crit make her a pure tank. Plus healing skill, plus healing. I think I'll put that on there. And healing skill, making him quite beasty for healing anyway. Just improve the healing a bit. Abomination, creating accuracy, maybe. See, that takes away against beasts. So I need more stuff that does more damage. Maybe this. Or humans. Because I haven't really got anything else that does much damage. Is the only issue. I would probably go for the, the same again with the Vestral, mainly for healing. She loses damage, but I can live with that. I can live with that. So, what am I going for? The Warren, that's more beasts in it. Quickly check in. Maybe that. Get rid of, try and take out the beasts, maybe. 
We'll see. Plenty of food, a couple of shovels. A few of these. Keys. Do I need antibiotics? Maybe, I don't know. To prosecute our war against the swine, we must first scout the squalid homes. Right. You already decided to just touch something. Have a quick check at G. Yep, moves fine. I need to try and get rid of some of their bad traits, but. I got two people that like to touch things. Great! Even better. At least that's a good, quick, straight run. We're already on the munching of the food, so. so I hope we get. What did she do? Lick the pages? Oh my god. What is that unholy beast? All right, calm down. No need to hit me like that. Jesus. Okay. Um, what's the stun like on this? Quite horrid, but... Oh, come on. Well, crit, but at least I wanted to... getting that damage out there before that thing decides to give me hepatitis or something continually onslaught destroy them all the abyss returns even the boldest gaze Remind yourself that overconfidence is slow it's good, and it's good the fact that we managed to get the some food back, but Jesus. Secrets and wonders can be found in the most tenebrous corners of this place. Didn't see the trap. Ambushed by foul invention. It's just not going well from the start. Traps lie in wait, unsprung and thirsting for blood. At least we're getting somewhere, scout chance. But nothing really great has jumped up at me. And we've already got an affliction. 
find it in no short supply. So things ain't going too good. Well struck. Can we get rid of destroyed vomiting piggy? We need to get rid of knocked him down to one, so that's good. Mainly doing this to build up the torch. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. At least I can de stress this way. I say build up that torch again. Decimated. There we go. Gives me a moment's breath. The wounds of war can be healed, but never hidden. Knocking that down a bit. Because if I can get rid of that, then that's good. Momentary abatement. Eradicated. In get rid of him. This expedition at least promises success. That's not too bad, remove the quirk, so... I got plenty of food, so that's all good. Not getting much stuff though. Maybe this could be where the hall is. Packs laden with loot. Are often low on supplies. No, 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 no. Him mm -hmm. and he's vomiting. Yeah, torch up. Get rid of him. Thank God for that. Just trying to keep stress to a lot. Oh. Sort of a minimum. A death by inch. 
ashes. Hmm. Why did you have to add stress on? A momentary abatement. Annihilated. A trifling victory. But a victory nonetheless. nonetheless. Good surprise them. of war can be healed but never hidden can we get rid of her press this advantage give them no quarter why has he still got horror on him Hell was that? Jesus. Need to uh confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. I can get rid of his affliction and I'll be fine. And it's just literally dealing with everyone else. A powerful blow. Twenty nine, so it's getting there. Just got to try and hope that no one else. Here, our old tentacle boy. A decisive pummeling. One more time. That's it, goes through that. Come on, crit needs. Stun. Thank you. Beautiful. As victories mount, so too will resistance. I might as well take it. I will use this. Camp away. Together. Furtive and vulnerable. Rats in a maze. Get rid of the stress for them. If not religious, 15. Don't particularly want to add stress to people. Twenty and one. Hmm. Not 
two left. On self, if not religious, if religious. Hmm. Probably just best to leave it. I've knocked my well, stress down for quite a bit. To be fair, I could have done a wound or something. I should finish him off anyway. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted and purpose is made clear. Now things seem to be leveling off. Stun him. Yes. Let's get our stress down a bit more. Roughly about the same. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Therefore, may finished. Broken. Maintain the offensive. I mean, got a terrible trinket, but. I mean, hopefully now we'll get uh, some cash. And then we'll be ready for a big... Adventure, maybe. I still need to upgrade some people. Damn it, I was hoping to at least finish him off. Uh, just damage him for a minute. See, that is beautiful and you get a nice a victory. crit like that. Perhaps the turning point. We can use that. Get yeah, hold of this. Uh got bandages as well. Might as well use them. And take that cash. A fortune waiting to be spent. I don't know if 100 gold is a fortune, but. If they're books, I'm going to be annoyed. What can I get rid of for this? 
probably that. Glittering gold trinkets in a bauble. I mean, that's not too bad. Paid for in blood. I thought it was gonna get messed up with like books or something. Uh, she's got 60, so that's good enough for me. To dispose of traps. Bloods first. I mean, what does blood first actually do? I do wonder that. So that was not really worth it. I want to try and grab as much as I can. And now the darkness holds dominion. Out. Black as death. If there's anything to grab at the minute. Oh, I can get rid of a... A package. Of course you have the stretch on. But goodbye. Stress down. I was hoping to uh, get the blight going, but. Oh, that's just dirty. He timed that one well, didn't he? Lucky we evaded it. Just use my time while I buy. The cake sounds some stress. Precision and power. Here are you. Masterfully executed. More blight. The slow death, unforeseen, unforgiving. What don't I need? I haven't seen anything with keys, really. 
Uh, he's carrying a soft. Not only is that in a perk I wanted to get rid of, but at least I don't have to pay for one to get rid of. No, don't, 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 don't. I had the stuff as well. Oh well. The swine folk's labyrinth may yet prove to be navigable. I'm now at level five. Eli. Faithless. Not going to get into the best ones, really. An exquisite example of craftsmanship. And futility. I suppose that could be handy for an uh, upgrade. Ooh. Elusive, evasive, persistent. Righteous traits for a rogue. Nice, but I really want to get another jester up there, really. Don't have any jesters that high. Uh, level I'm sh getting by should we say can I get anyone to upgrade it Does anyone need their arm upgraded I did do it with most people so And they don't get it, so. Oh, it's literally only one. One O oh, three. Great. Thanks. Chibi. I get rid of these then. And then see what the rest brings. Well, oh, sent them to the wrong one. I've yet to figure out how you can tell what's good and not not for certain people, or if it's just potluck. But we shall see. I mean, how much have I got for the Abbey? I've only got to exchange. Do that. And then all I've got is one more left, and then the whole hamlet has been upgraded. Beautiful. And on Prototype Gym, thanks for watching, and I hope to see you in the next episode. Goodbye!